Good morning, everyone. This is Med City CPA, and I'm doing a quick two minute tax topic video about traditional and Roth IRAs. So, in less than two minutes, I'm going to go over the high points. Uh, before we get started, please, for the love of God, please hit subscribe. I'm trying to get this channel up and going. Very much appreciate it. if you could do that. That'd be great. Hit subscribe. So, traditional versus Roth IRA. So, the number one difference between these two uh, are right here are my contributions deductible well Roth your contributions aren't deductible for traditional IRAs your contributions might be deductible so the limitation here is that if you have like an employer's retirement plan and you earn a certain amount then you might not be able to deduct all of the contribution right so here we are 2018 um, 5500 or 6500 uh, depending on your age uh, 2019 it goes up to 6,000 or 7,000 if you're above a certain age uh, and then your taxable contribution contribution so the smaller of those so here we are um, now this is many might want to take this with a big grain of salt uh, when can I withdraw the money well you can withdraw it anytime but there is what's called qualified versus unqualified distributions. So there is no tax. Your distributions are not taxable if it's a Roth IRA and it's a qualified distribution. But if you don't meet certain things, then you might be taxed. Plus you might have a 10% early penalty for withdrawals. So this is, ah, God. Okay, um, that's my two minutes.